Hi everyone, I'm Sang Kim. In the previous video, I showed you how to do single factor analysis of variance to test whether each average by treatment is the same. Once the result tells us there is at least one different treatment mean, we want to know which treatment has a statistically different mean compared to others. There are two types of error rate related to this analysis. The first one is about comparison-wise error rate, which controls error rate by fixing individual significance level. Shortly, we name it CR. The other one is about experiment-wise error rate, which controls error rate by fixing simultaneous significance level. Shortly, we name it ERR. In this video, I want to share how to do many individual t-tests here and LSD here, which controls ER. In the previous video, I showed you how to get MSE and LS means by treatments. So, like our program, uh, we uh, let's calculate standard error and lower competence limit and upper competence limit. So, standard errors it can be calculated by square roots of MSE, press F4, and over uh, number of observation. Yeah. Right. For lower competence limit, we can consider um, mean minus uh, T dot IMB uh, and uh, zero points. Uh, 975 because we consider 5% significance level and uh, in terms of degrees of freedom uh, should be 20 because there are 24 observations and 4 treatments and multiply by standard error alright for upper uh, competence limit we can use same formula for lower competence uh, limit, uh, but we only need to change minus to plus. All right. Let's calculate uh, 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 t-test, uh, individual t-test. So the first one uh, is uh, t-test between treatment one and treatment two. So the numerate parts, treatment one minus treatment two over uh, square roots of standard error of squared plus standard error of squared and then we need to uh, yeah cool and then we need to calculate p-value here so uh, in order to get p-value we can consider um, t dot uh, DIST dot uh, 2T because we consider two sided test and uh, X uh, we need to use this T statistic but this is minus so let's change it as uh, absolute value uh, okay and degrees of freedom should be 20 All right so the next one is between uh, treatment one and three, so one and three over yeah, we can use same uh, formula for p value. So the next one uh, between uh, treatment one and four, one and four over and p-value here uh, for uh, treatment 2 and 3 t-tests 2 and 3 
24, we can calculate the yeah, same logic. The last one between uh, treatment 3 and 4. Right, so as you can see, under 5% significance level, uh, there are three uh, t-test results which shows uh, uh, statistically significant difference. Significant difference, I mean. So, uh, as I mentioned, uh, if we do multiple t-tests like this, we compare uh, we compare the, the, the average by each group. So it's not like simultaneous uh, comparison, which we want to do. So uh, next one uh, is about uh, mean difference uh, between treatment by using LSD. So Fisher suggested this uh, least significant difference. Shortly, we name it uh, LSD. The concept of LSD is that uh, the difference between two uh, treatments uh, is greater than uh, this uh, LSD value, then we can say that there is a significant difference statistically. So let's calculate the mean difference first, this one. So between treatment one and two, so we can use the VLOCA function. Comma. Press F4. Minus, we look up, comma, press F4, comma, true. And let's use ABS function to make it positive. Cool. Let's calculate uh, the right part for uh, LSD value. So T, uh, this one, T uh, percentile, so T dot INV, 0.975, comma, and 24 minus uh, number of treatments, 4. And multiply by square root of 2 multiplied by MSE here and over. R. R is uh, number of observations. So, yeah, this one six. Yeah, so it means that uh, all treatments should have uh, same number of counts. Then we can use LSD. All right. So uh, it means that uh, the twelve means that at least uh, two uh, groups di uh, mean difference. Uh, should should be larger than 12. Then we can say that there is a statistical uh, difference in terms of uh, mean. So let's consider conditional format here. Highlight greater than this value. Yeah. And okay. Right. As you can see, uh, there are three uh, group. Uh, uh, mean uh, comparisons uh, having uh, st statistical difference. So this is how uh, we can do uh, LSD test and multiple t test. I hope it was uh, helpful for you to understand like Fisher's LSD and multiple t test. Please click like and uh, subscribe if it was useful for you to understand Fisher's LSD especially. Thank you.